Hello everyone and welcome to today's video where I am going to show you the miniature shopping haul that I have completed today and I bought a couple of these items the other day so I hope you enjoy bearing in mind this is only going to be like six items long so I hope you don't mind and I will see you in the video enjoy Okay, so we're going to start off with the most, the oldest item, let's go with. So I went to Primark when I went to my boyfriend's and I've been buying a lot of the inside, I'm not sure what you call these, air fresheners, but you, they're kind of like incense things, except you don't burn them, they just kind of Put them you put them in the liquid and then you put them in your windowsill and it makes your room smell nice so over there which you can't see at the moment i have a black rose and vanilla scent going on at the moment so once that one's finished i will be using this one which is number nine wild orchid and honey and this was from primark and it was three pounds cherry crush also used this is it cherry cherry i can't remember her channel name actually I'll link it below because she did a video on this and bought the same one as me and I commented and she commented back so I was very happy about that. I also bought, this is kind of a weird item for me, but I saw this in Primark and thought I'll give it a go. So I bought a peg basket. It's got 50 pegs. Okay, it's Primark. This was only £2.50 but I just thought when, you know, you're moving, it could be quite handy just to start off with. I know they're probably not the greatest quality pegs. But as a, just a starting off point, that was quite useful. So that was one, that was two pound fifty, sorry, in Primark, and you get fifty pegs. So if you're interested, they're in the homeware section. Go and buy some. Moving shops now from Primark onwards. So we're going to go with the things I bought today. So the first thing is this. Now you're probably thinking it's just a box. Well, it's more than a box because this is going to go as part of my memory box. It comes with one of those moisture removing thingies. Um, so basically this is like a floral design. It's really nice and it will fit inside the box that I'm using it for. Um, and this was only 2 99 from TK Maxx. So I just thought it was a nice little box to put any little treasures in that are in my memory box, which you will see at another stage. So yes, while I was in Prim um, Primark, TK Maxx even, I was given a treasure reward card. Now with these I was told that all you have to do is go online and register it and use your receipt from today and you can use it in TK Maxx and in HomeSense so expect more TK Maxx and HomeSense videos because if I can get loads of rewards I shall be going to them more often. So I do hope you don't mind TK Maxx and HomeSense. I know this video was highly requested that I went to TK Maxx and I will be doing a Birmingham shopping spray at some stage with my friend Polly Ann, so I hope you look forward to that as well. The final three items of this video, making it six items in total, were from the works. Now again, this is going to seem a bit strange, but I bought um, five A5 document wallets. Basically, you'll see why within this video, but I'm trying to sort out things in my memory box into little folders so that I can split it up in a way. Um, so I bought those, they were a pound in the works and I do have a works reward card as well so if you want to know all my reward cards maybe I'll do a video one day. The next item was this. Now I never buy, no I should rephrase that, I buy too many notebooks because I probably have probably 10 in my room right now, most of which aren't even filled up, but I use notebooks for everything, whether it's book writing, blogging, YouTubing, I use a notebook anyway. So all my notebooks have labels on normally, and this was one I found today. It's got all these little Scotty dogs on it. Um, and this was only two pounds, it would have been eight pounds, but it was reduced in the works again. So I just thought it was a nice little item. Finally, organisation was involved. So, as you all know, it is September very soon and we are approaching, dare I say it already, the end of 2017. 
So whilst I was in the works, I came across this. Now it's a 2018 diary. It's got loads of different elephants on it, which I really like. And inside you've got like, obviously your first page, your calendar, your notes. But I just thought it was really handy because you get like a whole page for each day. And when I'm doing my blogging and stuff, that kind of comes in handy because if I want to blog about things I've done on that day, I can write a big, you know, thing about what I've been doing. In a way, it'll be like a diary. I'll be writing it as a diary in here, but most of the time I'll be able to actually plan my day as well. So like, say I've got, I don't know, work between seven and four on Wednesday the third, I can then plan things afterwards. So it's quite handy having a big diary. I'm gonna try it out because I've never had a big diary. I always have like little ones and then run out of space to write. So I just thought it was really quirky, really nice, and it was only three pounds in the works. So I only spent six pounds in the works, two ninety nine in TK Maxx, and however much in Primark. Five pounds fifty in Primark. So in total, I've not even spent twenty pounds in the last couple of shops. So that's not too bad. But if there are any items you want me to have a look at, there was a peacock box in TK Maxx that I really liked. It was £10, but I was kind of in two minds because I was like, I've already got a dog box and I've already bought a little box. And I was like, I don't really need a peacock box as well, but I'm having second thoughts. So you may find I'll go and buy it. You may find that I leave it and find something else elsewhere. But there will be a little clip inserted at the end to show you what's happened to the dog box and... I will see you all in the next video so I do hope you enjoyed this one and I will see you for my next shopping video very soon if there are any shopping videos you would like me to do comment them below or snapchat me Facebook message me if you have me on Facebook or you know just basically message me anywhere and I'll reply when I can so hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you all very soon thank you for watching bye okay so, as promised, I said I'd show you what I now have in my dog box, so I've sorted it all out. It looks quite messy probably from your angle, but basically this is now my memory box. So with use of all those folders I bought earlier, I've sorted out all the bits of paper that I'm keeping, most of which are like service books, things I did at uni, uh, invites for things, and just events and things that I've done recently. I've also got cards from when I passed my GCSEs and obviously passed uni as well. Those are just little things. I've got my Breakfast Club Award. It should say breakfast, but it actually says breakfast. And I'm never going to forget that, you know, I was given that. I think I got second for that. I think that's why there's a two on there. And then in the new box I bought today is all the little bits of paper. Some of which is like tickets and stuff that I will sort out at another stage. But I've used that as like a little paper ticket box, if you see what I mean. So any bits of paper that I have a memory from or, you know, just anything in general. Postcards and all that are all in there. I have a box underneath here with key rings and stuff in. And then I have like things just tucked up the sides. So I've got some previous diaries that I decided to keep because it reminds me of the memories. So yeah, that's now in my dog box, so I'm going to carefully put all this back in, in a neat way, so that I can close it up again. Um, and one final thing to add to it is my neckerchief from my Wizard of Oz guide camp that I still have, and I was a member of the Red Wellies, so I still have my neckerchief that we made and decorated. So. Um, that's also going in there, because obviously that's a memory to me. And then I have birthday badges. And then this is now going to belong under my desk. I might actually tuck those down there. That's now going to belong under my desk. And it probably weighs a ton now. Oh no, not too bad. So anyway, this will live under my desk from now on. And I will be sorting out the rest of my room. And then going on another shopping spree. So I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you very soon.